for coming here this afternoon. You're attending a news conference with Dr. Steve Hatfield, who is the Justice Department's so-called person of interest, whatever that is, in the anthrax investigation. In the times that we're in now, the people now, it's called... And will agree to publish an op-ed reply from me to what they have published about me from me so far. I want to look my fellow Americans directly in the eye and declare to them, I am not the anthrax killer. I know nothing about the anthrax attacks. I had absolutely nothing to do with this terrible crime. Ladies and gentlemen of the media, it's your special burden. You have a special role in engaging. It is definitely not good to be the girlfriend of a person of interest. My girlfriend was locked inside an FBI car and hauled off to FBI headquarters and interrogated for hours without once being told she has the right to leave any time she wished. Her requests for a lawyer were delayed and made difficult. are a person of interest, your home is subject to search. It has an investigation that is characterized by the apparent avoidance of any major avenue of inquiry except the one decided upon by the Attorney General. Most importantly, it is driven by a compelling and overwhelming desire that the FBI look good at any cost, regardless of the price and individual freedom due process, common decency, and civil liberties. The protection of the person and for securing to the individual states uh, in this country. That is the right that has 